Toon Boom Harmony is an industry leading 2D animation software and in this series of lesson we're going to look at the basics of how to use Toon Boom and how to animate in it. So to start up with Toon Boom Harmony let me just go to my taskbar and launch the application. So this is, I'm using Harmony 17 uh, for this course and you can use either older or newer versions of Harmony software. More, moreover uh, the workflow would be the same. So Harmony is similar to Adobe Animate and you can also find my Adobe Animate uh, um, um, tutorial in my playlist if you want to learn more about it. But Toon Boom Harmony is much more designed for fluid character animations and uh, for much more refined for frame by frame animation. And usually larger production companies use Toon Boom Harmony while independent animators tend to use Animate. So let's move on forward. So once you open up Harmony, you see this and the first step we're going to do is to create a scene. So first of all, you need to give a name to the scene. So I'm going to say Tutor Tube just like this and I need to choose a location. So I need to browse over here and then I need to choose a location. In my case, I'm going to go to uh, my documents. So I'm going to go to my documents and over here, I'm going to create a new folder. And this is going to be for Toon Boom Tutor Tube. So this is where I'm going to save my folder. So let me just select this, select the folder. So all of my file will be there. And it's, it is very important that you choose a particular folder because unlike Animate or any other um, uh, 2D animation so uh, software, this actually stores it in uh, like a pro proper folder structure, just like uh, how it is in Maya for 3D animation. So now over here, once you choose the location, you have to choose the camera size. So if you were to expand this, you can see that there's a lot of cam a lot of format choices over here, like 4K, SD and film. But usually uh, this is the format that is most used, SDTV, 1080p, uh, 24 frames per second. So let us stick on to this right here for now. So this is 1920 and 1080, that's the SD size and field of view is vertical, so that's fine. So once um, I'm happy with my setting, I'm simply going to click on create scene. So once it, that we do that, it generates a bunch of files onto the folder that we selected and it does take time and uh, Toon Boom is a heavy software, so it does take time to process our things and that is quite usual. And now you can see that it has created uh, my my scene. So if I were to go on to my explorer right over here and if I were to see uh, the file, so let me just go on to my documents. So let me just go to my document and over here let me just go to uh, my file that is Toon Boom Tutor Tube right over here and if I were to go inside here you can see that all of the uh, folders have been divided according to the scene. So this is how it is stored in Toon Boom unlike Adobe Animate which only stores a single FLA file. So uh, you need to really keep the folder structure in mind. So once this is done, you can see that this is the interface and we're going to learn more about the interface in the upcoming lesson. But over here on the le left side, you can see that there's tools on the top are the menu bar and here are some of the brushes as you can see. So I can go over here and paint out different brushes and you can play out the animation right here. So uh, by default, it is set up for frame by frame animation just like this. But you can also do tweening and other type of uh, fluid animation in Toon Boom. So we're going to learn more about this in a future lesson. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.